SLS is a common household detergent that is often washed into our waterways. For this practical, you will be examining the effect of SLS exposure on marine life. There are six treatment groups of varying concentrations of SLS that you can see in front of you. You will be, you will be examining the effect that each of these concentrations has on the uh, organism that we're using. Artemia are collected 24 hours after hatching and they're exposed to the SLS detergent for 24 hours. You should now have formulated an idea or a hypothesis as to what we will observe for this experiment. To choose which treatment group you'll be examining, you should roll a dice as represented here, one through six. <clears throat> After choosing your treatment group, you will carefully collect one milliliter of organisms. So the next point to uh, take note of is that Artemia tend to clump together. They like hanging out with their friends. What you can see here is a whole bunch of Artemia swarming together. It's not so obvious, but they're also swarming here. What you will also notice is there's not many live Artemia around here. Um, you need to get a representative group of live and dead Artemia from this SLS concentration. Uh, so what we do is agitate them. Before I do that, you'll also notice um, there's some sort of non-moving brown dots here. Uh, they are Artemia cysts. They are the eggshells that the Artemia have moved from. So um, this will become much more obvious when you're up close and looking at the Petri dish yourself. So what we do is agitate. This will break up the swarm, homogenize, and so you'll be able to get a representative grouping of live and dead Artemia. Now, um, you, know, you need to collect one milliliter. So I've got, yes, that comes up, a pipette here. Uh, you'll notice that there is a texture mark around it that shows one milliliter. Uh, and also, you might want to avoid uh, as many of the cysts as possible. So just be very careful here. Take up one milliliter, approximately, and put them into your plastic dish carefully. Uh, to achieve statistical significance, you really need to count a total, that is alive plus dead, a total of 50 organisms. So um, you'll be able to tell fairly reasonably by just eyeballing that. You could put them on the dissection microscope and have a look. If you haven't got enough, come back and get an extra one milliliter um, of treatment group and then you can count. The Artemia tend to swim rather rapidly. Um, they're going to be hard to count, so the way we uh, approach this problem is to use something called, where are we, methyl cellulose. This is uh, generated from tree sap. It's an extremely viscous, uh, viscous solution, and what you do is just squirt that in on top, and I'd squirt in enough so that the liquid covers all the way across the Petri dish. This will make counting much easier. When you've almost got enough, just give it a swirl, close any air pockets there, and that will slow them right down.